Hello and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Poke One. I'm Dre Gottams, and after that rough episode uh, last time, figure we'll try to correct our wrongs by doing some PvP to start the episode and get a victory here, if possible. Seeing some cool hairstyles by Esper to Boy. Oh, or just Esperto Boy. One of those two. Either way, the, the hairstyles is, is crushing it. And uh, yeah, we'll see what we can do here. Just got a little squad that I slapped together. It's probably not the strongest, but um, yeah, we'll see how it goes. And uh, I recognize this name, um, so I think they're one of the top PvP guilds, or maybe the only people doing PvP. We'll see. Uh, we'll start off with our Talon Flame. We'll do our Talon Flame lead, which we, li we like to do often. Ooh, there's a Lycan Rock. Uh, you hate to see it. On the scissor. I think he, he'll probably just click Stealth Drugs, right? Expecting us to switch out? No, it's like Cell Rock. And that speeds him up? Oh, no, it's a Prio Attack. Okay. Um. I mean, we could Bullet Punch. Oh, okay. Focus Ash. Ooh! Okay. So he'll just click Excel Rock, right? And be faster? How much damage is that going to do to Arcanine? Does he have anyone else with a Pryo attack? He does. Um, I don't, I don't want to just give him up here, so I want to get out Arcanine, hopefully tank it with a minus one. Still a lot of, a lot of damage. And we can have just extreme speed. Oh. Oof. Wow, we got outplayed right there. Okay. Sludge bomb. How much does this do? Yeah. See if he switches out. I think about taunting, maybe. Oh, okay. He just goes sludge bomb. Does a lot of damage. Let's see how many focus sashes? Is he focus sashed? Like every is every person focus sashed? <laughs> Problem is he could just go lycan rock again, right? We're four times weak, so I don't think we live a plus one. We're going to Mimikyu. It's going to break our sash, but we don't have or our disguise. We don't have an option. So Xelrock is putting in some work here. I think he switches out, thinking we're going to Shadow Sneak. So let's just Sword Stance. We have to make a move to catch up. We're way behind. So he's either thinking about who to switch into or checking speed speed tiers. Oh, he goes Stealth Rock. Okay. Um, that's pretty good because I I guess that. Do we win? No, nah, we'll just Shadow Sneak. We sell rock here. I was gonna <laughs> Swords Dance again. Uh, but no, yeah, he would have just done Excel Rock twice. Here comes Lando. Which is fine. We have Mammoth Swine. But the rocks are going to um, stop us from having Scizor come in, right? Unless Scizor somehow lives it. I doubt it. Another question is, does he stay in with Lando or does he switch in to someone else, right? He doesn't take it. He takes the ice. I think he switches out, right? We got to make this call. He could just take it. I doubt it. I think it goes. Oh, okay. He went to Zumaril. I was hoping he's going Bisharp, but he went to Zumaril here. He could Aqua Jet. I think it's a Gudra switching. 
Hope okay, hopefully he, he goes Aqua Jet. He can't belly drum, so that's fine. Yeah, he Aqua Jets. Yeah, we take that fine. We should be faster, so if he wants to Aqua Jet again. Um, obviously Thunderbolt's the main play here, but he can go into Lando. I can't Dragon Pulse because he's a fairy. Is Flamethrower the best bet? Sledge Wave, I think Flamethrower is the safest. It's not, but that's not going to do enough here. I think we have to go Sledge Wave, and if he goes into Bisharp, he goes into Bisharp. Okay, cool, he won Braylon. There's another Focus Sash. Poison! Poison! Darn. Okay. We do have Sap Sipper, though, so we're fine here. And now, okay, now Flamethrower is a fine choice. It's like our safest thing here. Now the flamethrower is our safest thing here. Okay, so he's down. We might be in Aqua Jet range though, unfortunately. Bring in Lando. Which, which we're okay with. Do we need Gudra? Not really. The question is, do we need Talon Flame? I mean, I guess if this sharp it could be okay if, if, if a flame body procs a burn. So yeah. So I think we just uh, take the hit here. Did earthquake? If he's okay, he's not faster than us. He's faster than Talonflame, um, unless he's scarfed. And if he's scarfed, then it's earthquake. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh no, I need to bring in Scizor to... But Scizor probably dies too. Oh no. Uh, I feel so bad. I think we're probably going to lose now. Hopefully it goes... Okay. We needed that switch in to be into Azumarill. Which, you know, he wouldn't do that. But that's what we needed. Sucker Punch. How much damage does that do? Does a lot. <laughs> And we just don't have enough. Just not gonna do enough. And it was a crit. Oh man, this is a tough one. It's close though. I, I'm just curious, is it gonna do, it does 6%, right? But yeah, it's enough, yeah. The rocks. Uh, the rocks, the rocks did us in. Uh, but that was a good effort. But, uh, you know, so still on the losing streak, but that's fine. Uh, it, was cl it was not that close. The rocks, the stealth rocks. If we were able to take, take care of that, then we would have been fine. Let's go ahead and get into the episode. We have a lot of things. I might try to clear off some of these items, because I'm just getting a little <laughs> OCD about all the stuff on the screen there. Um, so we're in a different town. Let's put the squad in, and we're not going to lose, I'm not going to faint again, unnecessarily, so, you know, we're not doing that. So I'm going to put in strong, strong mons, 51, I think he's like, yeah, he's actually like got EVs and stuff. So I'll put him in, I still want to use guys that can level up, that can utilize the experience gain, but, I mean. I can't believe we died. I can't believe it. I shan't believe it. I won't believe it. And they just kind of had everything to like be super effective against us. So it, was, it, was, it was just a really weird uh, matchup thing that we went up, went up against, to be honest. Um, no, we, we, we can't have in Talonflame. I need to preserve that flying gem. Who else were we using? I mean, I do like extra drill. I think we can keep them in. Can I, we have water. Okay, we'll keep the squad like this for now because I need a flying type to get around. Let's see if there's anything worth doing on this list right here. Um, what is this purple thing? Find Arnie in the lighthouse? That doesn't seem accurate. There's no lighthouse right there, is there? Um, oh, it's this question mark thing. 
whatever the question mark is. No, let's not do that. Um, let's try some of these gold ones, I guess. I think the purple is just like the main quest line. And the gold is like next to the main quest line. So, let's meet Alder on the top of Celestial Tower. Uh, Celestial Tower, where are you? Oh, we could do this bridge one. That one's probably pretty easy. Okay. Let's do this bridge one. So, tough loss. That was annoying. But, decent try. We'll have to figure out. So, Landorus is probably a big Pokemon that everyone uses. And we did have Ice type. We need like a, f we need like a special ice. Oh, this ice beam. We could, we could go grab our star me. Cause there is a, a good deal of intimidate. There's a good deal of Lando, I'd imagine. Star me could be good. Star me should be faster than Landers, right? But if he's scarfed, I mean, with, he, yeah, he's gonna do earthquake. But we should be resistant. So yeah, star me could could have been good there. Um, Town Flames rough with the rock, so we might have to re readjust that. Okay, what are we doing here? Find Raph on the next bridge. Let's see if we can find Raph here. Or Ralph. Raph? Ralph? There's an item there. How do we get there? That's a gap. Let's get this item. Can we get there? Oh! Fight's here! The big bag. The big bag. What are you? Okay, level twenty. I was like, "Ooh, thank you for telling me uh, what will hurt you." I think we don't. We didn't have that Pokemon, huh? We probably should try to catch it. <laughs> Let's see here. Um. Oh no, duh. That was a, a trainer fight, anyways. So it's fine. Anything interesting here? I mean, yeah. Uh, like the Gothica. I think, yeah, I would like to get a Gothica, to be honest. And there you go. Speak it into existence. I don't know if I can hurt you without killing you. You are level 20. Who's my lowest? Do I have... I don't have, like, a Leech Seed or anything, huh? Do I? Superior? He might. <laughs> the only thing though is Gothitelle is good in like doubles, but are you good in singles? Okay, that's, <laughs> that's a lot of slaps. And yes, we did have Lucy. Perfect. Either way, let's just try to catch it. Um, how many Pokeballs do we have? Only 36? Probably shouldn't waste too many of them. I'll just switch out until it gets lower. Right. Seems like a smarter way to go. I wonder if people play doubles much on Pokemon. I know back in the day there wasn't as much doubles play. It was just mainly just just the singles, so it wasn't like the best thing to try to to try to queue up for. The wait times were just really long. But perhaps, oh, it's competitive, which is well, actually isn't bad. That's not bad, right? Could competitive be good in singles? She's, I mean, what, she has psychic move? It could be. We'll see. We'll take it, though. Add it to to the decks. We'll add it to the decks. Lock it in. Let's see what Backpacker is all about. See what that, see what his, his, his vibe is. Um, I don't like the looks of you. Oh, duh. This is, um, I was like, let me just run. Now we can switch into our grass type. It's not wild battles, it's trainer battles.
palpitate. Got the heart palpitations for the palpitate. Alright, here. Give us that. And we got a revive. All that for a revive. But I'm, I'm, I'm down. We don't have a Mancino either. Uh, we need to get something low, small, so we won't kill it. If we're fighting new... If we're fighting, like, wild Pokemon, trying to add to the decks. But, like, seriously, like, our boxes are so full, I don't know... We're gonna have to go through and just release anything that really has no value. I need to buy a bunch of Pokeballs and things. Yo, chill out. <laughs> Trying to be on America's Next Top. No, not Next Top model. What was it? America's. Oh, a singing idol? It's been so long, I forgot what the show's called. American Idol, there you go. I put American Idol and America's Next Top Model, like, mixed together. I mean, maybe Minchino could. Maybe she could go for Next Top Model. Does she have Cute Charm? Does she busts out the Cute Charm. She might be able to make it. Oh, come on. Let's throw out a Swift. Let's, let's try a Great Ball here. We have a lot of great balls. And there we go. Lock it in. Mancino. Welcome to the squad. Ooh, more items. Okay, sink. I think we'll just run away from the rest at this point. Frisk. Okay. I mean, Frisk is good too. Yeah. I guess so we can find out for her we can find out uh oh full on light part, huh? We don't have you. Oh we do have you. Peace out then. What? I know he's fast, but come on now. Ooh, what's here? Warning, do not enter. Um Scary. I don't think we're big enough for this. I'm not going to lie. I don't think we're ready for this. At all. But they tells us not to enter. So what do you think we're going to do? You guessed it. Driftville Bridge K. What? Where are we? What is this? Your time has not come yet. Oh, okay. We're not, we're not good enough for this place yet. Okay, cool. cool. So, that is something to keep in mind now. The music was really creepy too. I mean, I'm not really trying to do this right now. I should probably pop a uh, escape rope. Because like, so it's either going to be Frisk or it's nothing, right? It's Frisk. Or nothing happens, and then if you go into switching an, an, an intimidator, and then it doesn't get the competitive, then you know like that she had the hidden ability. So at least she's one that you can get the hidden ability on without having. Who are we looking for, Raph? Without having to catch it first, which is helpful. It's a little easy to hunt. A little, a little easier to hunt. Is Raph here? Doesn't look like it. What is this? Okay, from Wrath, uh, location, Village Bridge, Tubuline Bridge. This is, so that's not that one. So which bridge is it? I guess it wasn't that. Where is it? Oh, is, is it that, it's that bridge? Okay. Uh, let's fly. Let's try. I guess maybe that dot was for Sages, Mitch Sharon? Path of the Strong. Oh, that's what that is, I think. 
I think that's where we were, right? And did we see her? We just didn't, didn't talk to her, huh? Yeah, okay. Let's go back. Let's talk to her just so we update that quest. And it looks like we're not big enough yet for that. We're not gigantic enough. Okay, okay, okay. So we passed. I'm surprised it didn't just activate. Strength, strength alone is what matters in this world. So I believed until I met Alder here. But winning in Pokemon battles isn't all there is to life. Once I learned that lesson, my eyes were open to many different things. We all have our own brand of strength, people and Pokemon both. The strength to make our own dreams a reality, the strength to protect what we hold most dear. What do I think this way now? Or why do I think this way now? It's thanks to you, Drake Adams. Well, and Bianca. And Alder. If only N could see this, too, someday. I'm going to take a long, hard look at myself on Victory Road. I'm going to think about what I can do and what I and who I can become. Visit me sometime if you want. We'll have a battle like old times. Okay. So, on Victory Road. So, maybe that'll just be like... Daily or weekly battle quests from him. Okay, so it looks like this is the bridge that we need to go to. Have we been to this bridge? Probably have been. We even land here? Oh, we haven't even been here yet. There's like a whole new area that we haven't been to. We're doing that other side quest. Or main quest. Let's find out. Let's see if we can travel this bridge. I think we went here once and we couldn't cross it yet. Good. It's nice to get in some some of these side quests. Take a little a little break from from the main storyline. Anything cool here? Not really. Amoongus. Um. Anything else? No, not really. You know, our own Bisharp would be nice too, but only if it's a uh, hidden ability, though. You'll never imagine how many countries I've visited and how many trainers I've fought. Okay, so I think this is just a whole new area. How big are they? 65. Yeah, whoa, okay. So, I think we're underleveled for this too. And he's ice, we're dragon. I mean, he is just one, one Pokemon. He just... He just clicked sheer cold. Okay. He clicked and landed sheer cold. Hmm. Hmm. What's in here? See, I think this is probably just a new area that we haven't been to yet. I don't recognize it. Yahoo! There's an awful lot of nothing around here, isn't there? Okay. Uh, yeah, if they're that big, then that's going to be a problem. I enjoy working as a ranger, but I love to spend my time with Pokemon. Whatever happens, I won't leave my Pokemon. So yeah, so maybe we are supposed to do this after we do more of the main quest stuff? I don't know. But what I was going to say before I just got one shot with Sheer Cold <laughs> uh, is that since it's only one Pokemon in his party, he was uh, probably stronger than the average level around here. So, I imagine 61 to 62 is probably the level that we should expect to see here. Let's try to try get some more experience again. Let's see what happens. Let's try. 
We have to find a raft. What the heck? Village Brit. Oh, okay, yeah. That's where we're supposed to go. Well, how do we get down there? Oh, waterfall. We don't have, do we have waterfall on him? We do. Okay, this might work. But we don't have surf. <laughs> we, have, we have waterfall, but no surf. Oh, lovely. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. Um, okay. Let's finish this rap thing. <laughs> Call it a day. Um, Cause yeah, waterfall is good in PvP, but uh, surf not necessarily. At least not for uh, Gyarados, right? Cause he's a, a physical attacker. Uh, yeah, so this is a new area. Uh, so yeah, we don't we don't have both of those moves to get down that waterfall. Village bridge. Okay, so this is the area. Oh wow. It's almost like kind of like singing. I, I, we haven't heard vocalization yet in any of the music. During the day, I sunbathe. During the night, I moonbathe. It really? Do, well, what time is this? Let us know. Nature sinks into my body. It's people hooping. They're hoopsters. You have great sparkles. Sparkles in your eyes. Please make our hoops, our dreams come true for us. Go grab the glory go... Oh, go grab the glory. Go take on the world. Also, say so the glory glow stick. Oh, you look pretty good. Let's play some pickup. Wait, what? Oh, imagine if we actually started playing some pickup. What in the world is this? What is this? Uh, earthquake. Who are you gonna hit? We have elevate. Elevate, elevate, elevate. And okay, good. We have another flying type. Switch into Honchkrow. I could have switched into Superior. Oh wow! I guess I should have. Okay, so it doesn't hit all the way. So yeah, I should have brought in Sur Superior there. Normally, Earthquake is supposed to hit all adjacent foes, but I guess in a three-person battle, he isn't quite adjacent in that sense, which is interesting. Um, let's just click Rock Slide. It's not going to hit anything. Earth Power, Elekid, and I guess just Giga Drain. Screeched. Oh, wow. Dude, this would be some damage. I mean, I know it's a crit, but it's still decent for a bunch of people. Okay. Okay, we're getting some XP this way. That's a game. You totally crushed me. Should we play this other hoopster? Honchkrow's dead, but maybe that's fine. Fooling you, hair and square. That's what I call a trick play. It's okay, more people weak to um, Earthquake, so. Earthquake, Earth Power. I mean, now we switch into Superior, we get burned up, right? So I think we're just gonna stick with him and go Extreme Speed. No, we'll go Close Combat. Yeah, yeah we tanked that. We're a dragon. Nice. So you two are dead. You guys are fast? Magmar's down, Magby's down. Okay. Well done, well done. Bop, 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 bop. Swords dance, earth power, to the power, times two. Let's what it do. It's nothing new. Does he just absorb it? Does he have like a fire absorb? Okay, he does. Cool. What the hoops? <laughs> what the hoops? Maybe just don't people talk like that. I was the one who was tricked. I mean, you got bamboozled. 
So is this a village bridge? Is this like a like a a town or actual just a place where we're just gonna be lots of battles? Because we're kind of low. I think we're gonna go ahead and end here. It's an interesting episode. Trying out some new things, trying out some of these quests. Uh, we're, you know, we'll keep bouncing around, doing different things to keep things fresh. Um, hopefully, eventually, one of these days, we'll we'll get another win in PvP. <laughs> but uh, until then, as always, I've been Drake Adams, and you have been great. I'll see you next time.